We were praying together, we were um, discussing certain things. Well, the Lord bring some clarity and uh, also some uh, tactical approaches in the spirit, I should say. Is that a good word to put it, brother? So, yeah, so, yeah. I saw a couple things. Well, the first thing I saw was like a campfire and there was a pot that was sitting on this, this campfire was obviously being heated uh, by the fire and the uh, impression that I have is obviously a purification it was, uh, you know, the process of the dross being heated, lifted to the surface and then mm. skimmed off. I also saw a... Uh, a press. I, I believe it was probably a duck. You know what a duck press no. is. And there was a hand turning the press, and of course the the liquid was you know coming out oh. onto the plate as the hand was mm. turning the, the press to mm. uh, uh, you know produce that the juice. Desired, mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. What what is the press under? Um, the uh, a press would be like a uh, in this case it it it, it kind of reminds me of a duck press Wouldn't it? where I, I'm not exactly sure in terms of the culinary uh, but you know there's a press that uh, occurs pressing process to get uh, you know a juice or to press out the oil yeah I believe it's uh, I really don't know <laughs> this there's a liquid that's coming out I'm not really exactly sure what it is what, what duck press no well, let's, let's look up at yeah, it I heard duck press, and I don't okay. know necessarily the nature of it. I have no press. idea what duck press yeah. is. Mm -hmm. Not too familiar. I think it's. it's yeah. Are you talking about olive oil? Duck press. Alright, so press duck. Uh, the complex dish is a specialty of ruin and it's fish attributed to. I'm just curious. Oh. It consists of various parts of the duck served in a sauce of its blood. Oh, it's a duck. Which is extracted by way of a press and it's been considered the height of elegance. Mm. I, I don't know. I, I, I don't, not, I don't really know. It's not really It's not an oil at all. It's no. a duck. Yeah, yeah. Okay. right. Mm -hmm. hmm. Interesting. Hmm. So yeah, I don't know necessarily. I <laughs> never heard of that thing. So but I uh, the first time believe I believe it was a duck press so that that I well, previously well, heard. Of. So anyway, Father, we just thank you, Lord. We uh, uh, praise your name, and uh, indeed, may your work be accomplished, Father. May the the uh, uh, wisdom of you, Father, continue to to come forth into our lives and continue to to to. Free us, Father, from the bondage. I think God Lord will Father. not allow anything for the ground. Mm. He will do what He needs to do. Mm -hmm. Therefore, the challenge is temporal, and the setbacks are needed for purification, you know, for sanctification. So, mm. I worry the more is about the the children, you know. Mm. So when when things not with apply properly mm -hmm. to children is very, very much damaging to, mm -hmm. to their future. Do we have other placement to offer? I don't think that's a, that's a problem, right? The problem is, are we one or devoted or not? And children notice that. So mm -hmm. Are we believing what God is doing to us is the best and needed? Mm -hmm. Children feel that. So we have voices that said, there is other way. You're not doing a good job. But God is not with us. Yeah. Whatever you're doing, I don't sure. I'm not committed. You know, yeah. so you know, there's season for that, grace for that. But when that season's over, especially when it's so impactful for young people's heart and mind, mm -hmm. so mind, uh, mind that it be very difficult. So there's a reason why the East Lake Virgin is a whole generation passed away. Why? Because that generation is totally incapable to really identify and come into 
the the calling, the future vision of the Lord, and the the incapable to commit to it, fully commit to it. You think the people born in the wilderness, they're now facing the oppression, but they also don't. Wilderness pretty much a normal life for them, you know. So, but when they heard their promised land, you know, they have no promise that that's good for us. You know, want some water, want some grain, want some grapes, you know. So, want some milk, honey, you know. So, therefore, that's interesting. A、uh, human nature, because you now, and、uh, the place where the Israelites came from. Egypt, for example, they still, even they are slaves, they still、uh, think that's their land. You know, it's a good land. You know, so、yeah. it's at least not wilderness. Yeah,、also. right. Yeah. <laughs> even their life, the culture, the nothing God there, but that's 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 not bad life. You know, we still have an our river. We have all the fields, all the crops. We can, we can have some spices. I come garlic. You know, so. By the mercy of the master, <laughs>、yeah. but to be land owner, real land, that's like incapable to really identify with that. But that's that's a problem. So people don't like this word slave mentality or orphan mentality. But that's in the Bible. That's the Lord teaching and the Bible teaching. We like it or not,、mm-hmm. it's not not up to human standard or what you feel as a human being. So. <laughs> Yeah. Finish your prayer, brother. So, see us, Father. We do. We just pray and continue to transform us, Lord.、Uh, we thank you for your heart, Lord. We must be sons. We must have raise up sons.、Mm-hmm. If I was not incapable, incapable to, to be sons, and not able to raise up sons, it's a corporate effort. Well, God knows how to deal with them. So, yeah, it's not.、Uh, In the end of days, you know, it's God. Everything is God to do it. He built the house, so、mm-hmm. no man can do it. Go ahead. Indeed, Father, may you raise up sons. Just pray this, Jesus.、Mm-hmm. Bless you, brother. <laughs>、yeah.